Hi everybody, it's me, Chef Scott, coming to you almost live from Seattle, and today we're here for flaky pie dough. You need these things, so get them together. A half a pound of cold, unsalted butter, two and a half cups of all-purpose flour, tons of sugar, a teaspoon of salt, a half a cup of ice water, and a half a teaspoon of vinegar. Here's my sugar, I'm gonna put it in my flour, I'm gonna put the whole thing in my stand-up mixer. This is my salt, I'm just gonna put it right in. You could use kosher salt if you like, or sea salt. This is vinegar, and uh, I'm using the Bragg's Organic. You could use any kind. You could use your uh, champagne vinegar, say. Mm. You wanna chill that for about 15 minutes in the freezer. And then you wanna cube your butter. And you don't wanna bother washing your hands or getting the boogers up from your fingernails while you're uh, getting ready to film a video or anything. Please don't touch the food, chef. Ew. Oh, I wonder who had to eat this pie. Huh, probably nobody, maybe, I don't know. Anyway, you wanna chill your butter in the freezer for about 15 minutes, wash your freaking hands, okay? And then come back and make your pie dough. Okay, that's all butter that's been chilled for about 15 minutes in the freezer. I'm gonna put it back in our mix. That's our flour and our uh, sugar, remember? And we're gonna mix it on number one only until we get, uh, it's gonna bash the butter around and turn them into these little boulders like this. You find a boulder, smash it, Smash it. So take it about walnut size, find the little boulders, smash them flat. Very nice, very nice. Now we're gonna add our water. You can still see my butter's pretty chunky in there. This is my water, my vinegar, and my salt. This is as patient as you have to be. Everybody ready? This is streaming the old way. Now you may find that you need a tablespoon or more of water. Go ahead and put that in your uh, cup and then add it gently. Um, you don't want a wet dough, but it is better to have a moist dough over a dry dough. So you can see here that we've got like a perfect dough. It's a shaggy mass, that's what we like. All that, uh, it's not really come together as homogenous. It's still kind of chunky and lumpy and shaggy and hairy. We like that. Keep it just like that. Try not to smush it together unduly. We're going to flatten it here in a minute and we're going to roll it out eventually. But right now that's helping us keep some uh, space between the uh, stuff. Keeps your, keeps your pie dough nice and flaky. We're going to bring this just together so we can measure it. You know, so we can get like an even steven sort of a thing here. Ba -dum, bum, bum. Ah, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun, dun dun Nice. Okay, right? There you go. Now, even steven it. I not quite even, but here you have two doughs. Now you have a, a bottom and a top, or two bottoms. Um, you know, and who doesn't love that? <laughs> Flatten them out round. I assume you're gonna make a pie. Pie shells are usually round, so start round, end round, you know, that's pretty easy. Wrap it up. Um, you can still see the butter is mottled here. It's gonna make it very flaky when you roll it out wrap this you put it in your refrigerator for no less than 30 minutes to a couple of days you can make your pie doughs your empanadas your uh, your uh, apple pie fries maybe just something for the family uh, thanks for watching you guys happy holidays to everybody let me know how your pie comes out talk to you soon